Hello Internet, welcome back to another episode of Xenoblade Chronicles. In the last episode, the Mechon began attacking Colony 9, but Dunban came to save the day just in time. Again, I really do not recommend you fight all these Mechon. You can still get great things from these chests by beating them, like those Night Goggles. But we're playing as Dunban, they pose no real threat, and we can easily just run past them. This is one of the few points in the games where enemies will continue to lock on even if you're over 10 levels higher than them. Uh, because they just really don't like Dunban, I guess. That would make sense. He murdered a whole lot of them about a year ago. But yeah, similar to in the last episode when we were running away from the Mechon, I recommend you run away from them even when you have the Monado. Just because there's no point. There's no point in trying to get the experience from these. <laughs> I think I just went around an entire circle from where I was actually supposed to go. Which... I mean, that takes talent to be that bad at Xenoblade Chronicles. But I am. Dunban! You can't take any more of the Monado! But I must! I don't have a choice! <laughs> Ryan's right. You can't go on like this. Shulk! Dunban. Hey! <sighs> this time... It's my turn! Shulk! No! It'll kill you! Shulk! <sighs> <sighs> Using the Monado. What was that? Shulk, more company. Ryan. Right. Ryan, Dunbar. I got your back. Shulk, do you feel all right? I'm okay. But there was something strange. Just now, it was as if I could see into the future. Is this another power of the Monado? See into the future? What are you saying? Uh, are you certain, Shulk? Yes. I see. I remember Dixon saying that the Monado had a hidden power. Could this be it? What? Don't think about it now! Just believe what the Monado showed you and fight! Got it! If you still want to continue playing as Dunban, he does have a completely unique moveset with a completely new set of arts as well. However, we're going to be playing as Shulk. Shulk's talent art has been replaced with a Activate Monado, which means we can now use Monado Buster and Enchant using Shulk. Which is great, because I was honestly really not used to Dunban only having access to those two arts. Uh... And now we can just do it all as Shulk. We can just use Monado Buster in a chain attack and this fight near instantly. Not not completely. Why did Ryan get so many arts so quickly? I swear he did not have this many in the last episode. Okay. Well. We can't really do anything as him right now, so... Let's do Aura Burst. And then... Gale Slash. I guess. Okay. Well, I was honestly expecting Buster to do a lot more damage. I think I overestimated uh, how easy casual mode makes this game. 
But we can now continue on this way, and again, you can ignore all the mech on. I wouldn't necessarily recommend it. One thing I would recommend is immediately trying to get your talent gauge all the way up. Uh, not your talent gauge, your party gauge. Because um, that is going to play a big role in an upcoming fight. Uh, because if you couldn't tell, this is a big part of the game. There will likely be a boss. So this is one of the few parts where I can actually recommend fighting all these mech on. I am also, once I have a good party gauge build up and uh, am near the boss, going to turn off casual mode just so the boss fight will last longer. Uh, because in casual mode, it will not last like 30 seconds. And that's unfortunate because there's something unique about it. And it would be nice to have that uh, unique thing last for more than literally like 10 seconds. Since this is just an approach to an area that we've already been to, I will speed it up uh, and just, I mean, yeah, that's all, I'll just speed it up. Uh, because it's just going to be me here trying to, trying to keep the party gauge up for a good bit. I'm turning off casual mode now. And now we just have to rush forward before the party gauge depletes too much. Anyway, Shulk got a new art called Shadow Eye. This reduces aggro and increases physical art damage, which is extremely good because Shulk cannot have aggro. We have a chain attack. I'm not going to use it right away, but you may notice even with the Monado, we are only doing one damage. That's unfortunate. Uh, can you not focus Shulk, please? I'll heal Shulk since he has aggro. We are not in casual mode right now, so we can e very easily die here. If he doesn't use last resort. The Monado! It's not working! Oi! What do you mean? How can that be? The Monado should cut through Mekon with ease. What? What is that light? Other Mekon don't have that. Could. Could that light be why the Monado has no effect? Shoot! Right! Get down! Stay back! I'll take it from here! No! You can't take any more!
Fiora. Ah, oh, the breeze feels so good. Yeah. I'd forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Ryan. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> It's so peaceful. You know, Shulk, I hope every day can be like this, always. Hey. Have you been to see Dunban? Yeah. I just can't do it. You got more guts than me. Not at all. It was him that consoled me. Oh. I guess that's the type of guy he is. Yeah. Even without the Monado, he's the strongest person I know. Uh... Shulk, how are you holding up? I'm fine, but... you... I will shed no tears. Huh? A year ago I felt the same sense of deep loss that I do now. The Battle of Sword Valley. After that battle, many of my friends did not make it home. While I was being brought here on that stretcher, they were all I thought about. <sighs> but I decided I would not cry. Everyone who died in that war had something they wanted to protect. Family, friends, loved ones, their home. So they fought to protect them. And we won. No matter how painful, no matter how hard, it's nothing to be sad about. I decided that there and then. Dumban. Shulk, 
Fiora would tell you the same thing. <sighs> she wanted to protect us. Or rather, she wanted to protect you. And you're alive now. So, I will not cry. Okay. Remember the gift of life that Fiora gave you. And treasure it. I... I can't say that I understand. But... I hope to. Someday. That is all I ask. Believe me, I'm always just trying to understand. Treasure the gift of life that Fiora gave you. He's one of a kind, that Dundan. I've made a decision. Huh? My purpose in life. I will pursue that faced Mekon. Shulk. They attacked our colony. Kill Fiora. I will find that Mekon. Find it and destroy it. Destroy them all. <laughs> what are you laughing at? Sorry, sorry. It's just a bit weird. I never thought you'd be the one to say it. So you agree? Of course, man. I'm just surprised you came out with it first. You thought I'd try and talk you out of it? That's not what Fiora would want. That sound right? Yeah. Something like that. I thought you'd give me a hard time. In my head, there are two versions of me. One of them is saying that. It's telling me, listen to what Dunban said. What about the other one? It keeps shouting, make them pay. Destroy every single one of them. And it won't stop getting louder. That doesn't sound like you. Sure, it ain't my voice in there. Might be. It's a bit of a loud mouth. There you go, then. <laughs> <laughs> so, when are we heading off? Right now. Perfect. Right then. Yeah. Look after yourselves, boys. As soon as this heals, I'll be right behind you. And then we will seize our destiny together. <laughs>